One Laptop Per Child announced this week that they will debut a prototype XO3 computer two years ahead of schedule. The tablet, of which you're seeing a rendering here, will eventually cost 75 US dollars, according to OLPC's founder and chairman, Nicholas Negroponte. At CES, we will show a tablet uh, that can be and will be used for children, probably in the developed world, that will allow us to start testing many of the things that combine, if you will, a laptop and an iPad and a Kindle, and sort of take those and put them into one, into one device. The $75 mark, we're going to hit it. That's not, I, that's not a problem. What is a problem uh, at the moment is when will we get plastic? Because we really want this to be 100% plastic, uh, unbreakable, sort of ex almost extruded out of the machine. CES 2012, we'll probably see that. C CES 2011, it'll be glass. He said that the X03 will run an ARM processor and that the screen would be nine or more inches. The first prototypes would most likely run Google's Android operating system, but he said it's ultimately an open source Linux laptop. And more important than anything else, and that's why I say God willing, you'll see uh, a dual mode display, one that works both in the sunlight and backlit. And to me, that's one of the biggest features we need for our kids. Our kids are outdoors a lot, and just having it backlit doesn't quite work for outdoors. And just having it reflective doesn't quite work for nighttime and especially in places where there's no electricity. OLPC has had a tough road with hitting promised price points, so we can only wait and see if the group's latest offering comes in on budget. Reporting from the MIT Media Lab in Cambridge, I'm Nick Barber, IDG News Service.